la màgia de Bollywood en viu i en directe. Les cançons més populars de les millors pel·lícules de Bombai són el nucli d'aquest espectacle d'espectaculars coreografies. No, no és una imatge del final d'Encuentros en la tercera fase. És un moment, desenfocat això sí, de l'assaig de Bollywood de Show al Teatre Tívoli de Barcelona. Teatre en un programa de cinema? Sí, avui citarem en Ferran Adrià i us parlarem de fusió. L'èxit del cinema de Bombai és l'origen d'aquest musical. És com veure una pel·lícula Bollywood però en viu i en directe. I ja ho sabeu, quan escoltem la paraula Bollywood, els del cinematògraf aixequem les orelles, pugem sobre el nostre elefant de colors i anem on faci falta. Perquè... algú es pot resistir a una cosa així? If I had to describe Bollywood, I would describe it as energy, zest, and I don't think so people need to know Bollywood. I think it's the soul in which the performers perform, the energy, the expression, the dance uh, style that they have that can let a person start dancing who does not even know Bollywood. When they come here, that's when they'll start following up on Bollywood because they'll get the first taste, which will be amazing. Així ens definia Vaibabi Merchant l'espectacle. Com ella diu, no és necessari ser un entès de Bollywood per deixar-se seduir per aquest xou. La història és un clàssic. La noia que vol triomfar al món de la música, però que ha de passar per nombrosos entrebancs per aconseguir-ho. En aquesta versió índia de Mamà quiero ser artista, la protagonista és Ayesha, una noia del Rajasthan que practica les tradicionals danses folclòriques, però que vol triomfar al glamorós món de Bollywood. Viatja fins a Bombai, oposant-se als desitjos del seu avi per convertir-se en una coreògrafa d'èxit. Bollywood de Show és una expressió total del cinema popular indi. Hi trobem la música, les coreografies, la història d'amor, els estira i arronsa familiars, l'espectacular direcció artística, el fabulós vestuari, la combinació de la dansa tradicional i la moderna. Tot és aquí. Per una vegada la frase, una experiència per als cinc sentits, no és només un reclam promocional. The show in total, I can say, has all kind of elements. Elements of laughter, elements of rejoicing, because we have so many festivals and we show those festivals in the show. And the most important part is that I have noticed we as humans, now it's not necessary for me to be an Indian or you to be Spanish or Australian or German or American or anybody. We all, deep down inside, Love the emotion of crying, you know, moments that make us cry. And that's a very integral part in our show because there are those emotional moments that we as humans hold ourselves back in our day-to-day -day life because we don't want to show the other person we are weak. But here you're sitting, you see it happening live and that's what actually helps because everyone likes to cry and everyone likes to laugh. And everyone leaves the theater extremely elated, high with enthusiasm because that's the reaction we got last night and we expect that, if not more. Bollywood de Show no és només música i color. També aprofita el seu vessant d'ambaixador d'una cultura forània per explicar-nos coses de la tradició i arts indis. Carol Furtado, la protagonista d'aquesta història d'amor i ball, ens comenta el poder didàctic de la funció. It's, it's not only entertaining, it's also an educational trip. Uh, it educates you about India, about the kind of people we are, about our culture, our traditions, um, our dance forms, our rituals, our customs, and the kind of people we are, our humor, and what India is today, that is what we portray in the show.
Film Metropolis Bombay és la companyia que produeix aquest espectacle amb sabor a curri. Un show amb 50 músics i ballarins en escena i un fil argumental que acosta al públic a les trames habituals d'aquest tipus de films. Fins i tot hi trobem l'humor. Bollywood es mou sovint per l'homenatge i l'autoparòdia. Però entendran els espectadors catalans aquesta comicitat típica de les produccions índies? I do. Sometimes people don't understand also because of the language barrier or because their sense of humor is a little different. But most of the times I think we've been lucky that people have actually laughed on those points where... So people find that funny. Like, and touch what they do. I hope they keep doing, finding that funny. <laughs> Un espectacle amb tan bon rotllo segur que arrossega el públic a participar en la seva espiral de seducció. És veritat que la gent d'aquí és molt freda? O ens deixem emportar pel seu ritme i acabem convertint-nos en uns bojos pel ball? Sí, poden. Poden, definitivament, poden, fins que poden crear un riot per ells mateixos i no els deixen que els altres veuen, que és per això que només cap a l'inici que els altres deixen de deixar-los de deixar-los de deixar-los because we kind of uh, excite them to do that because during the show it's kind of a problem for the for the others because others are not so receptive or people want to watch and if you stand in in you know a theater like this the people behind you can't see and things like that so it's towards the end it's like an explosion you know there's so much euphoria and all of that so people automatically stand because they can't contain it in themselves anymore I per acabar el reportatge, preguntes d'examen a les dues. A veure, títols mítics del mític Bollywood que us hagin meravellat i actors i actrius favorits. I like all kind of films. I, I like watching films that are not good, have not done well in, in the box office because I know what happens, how much pain it is, how much hard work goes in, how much teamwork goes in to make a film. I like Amir, Amir Khan, uh, Rithik, Rithik Roshan. My favorite actress, I would say uh, Shri Devi has been my all-time favorite. She's not acting anymore, but she has been uh, my favorite. And uh, as far as... <laughs> yeah, oh yeah! Yeah, so she was... Uh, I, I, I grew up watching her. In terms of uh, men, well, I, I would say Shah Rukh. It's because I've always liked him from the beginning. So, Shah Rukh is among the men. <laughs> My favorite Bollywood movie. Well, there are lots of them. Um, I wouldn't know which one. Okay, f uh, I would say at the moment, uh, Devdas. Yeah, because uh, I like it because the cinematography is fantastic. Director and the producer has spent the the it, it's the it's the biggest budget film in India. Some crores on it, and uh, the choreography is fantastic. The soundtrack is brilliant, you know. So, which is why I think that that uh, movie is one of my favorites. No us perdeu Bollywood de Show o com entrar a la fantàstica indústria del cinema de Bombai per la Porta Gran. Mamma mia, quin musical! Qualsevol se'n va un cabaret a venti aquesta explosió de llum, música i color al Tívoli.